So, ito na yung, la ito na yung last question natin, Grace. Maraming yung tatanong na ito. And mostly lahat ng tao, milyong-milyong tao, gustong-gustong malaman to And yun yung mga tinatanong sa atin. So, paano kayo naghiwalay? Six million ways to die. Choose one. Alright guys, welcome back to my vlog. Ito na yung pinakihintay nyo, yung part 2 na request nyo. And syempre kasama natin si Miss Grace. Hi! Uh, so ayan guys, ito na yung part 2 ng, uh, ng Choose Ko Po vlogs natin dito sa Choose One Channel syempre. And dahil marami nagre-request ng part 2, ito na guys at maraming nabitin dyan. So pumili ako ng siguro 5 or 10 questions sa, sa comment nung last time. Itatanong natin kay Ate Grace kung... Kung pwede rin niya sagutin, syempre hindi naman lahat masasagot. So, ayan, kamustahin muna natin si Ate Grace. Ate Grace, kamusta ba? Mabuti naman. Mabuti naman. So, ilang ilang weeks na rin to guys bago namin ginawa yung una. So, syempre, ngayon lang ulit kami nakita ni Ate Grace. Ano naman mga pinagkaabalahan mo, Ate Grace? No, mga past two weeks. Two weeks ago na, no? Mm -hmm. Do you mean like what have I been doing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, same thing. Just working mm -hmm. and um, keeping in touch with my kids because... Um, my kids are with him right now, so I'm alone with the dog right now. I have to, I have to say, I have to speak in English because my, my mom na sabi na, my nagmasis sabi na, you have to speak in English because hindi namin na intindihan. No, I have a cousin who's uh, Ilocano. Oh, he, he was born in Hawaii. Yun lang na intindihan niya is Ilocano. So when we speak in Tagalog, hindi niya na intindihan. So at the grace, alam natin na maraming nabitin sa mga kwentuhan natin last time. So yung mga hindi ko na tanong sa iyo ate, uh, ilan ba kayong magkakapatid pala? Uh, my 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 dad was married before my mm. mom so he had 10 kids. I think four boys, four four girls. That was uh, he remarried and he had mm. me and my me and my sister. So lahat sila nandito na din sa US. No, um, there's three brothers here and one sister. Mm. And then me and my sister and the rest, uh, they're in the Philippines. And one of them died here and the rest, uh, they're in the Philippines. So, so ilan total? So all together, 10. 10. Wow, yeah. 10 kayo lahat. So ngay ngay ngayon ko lang din alaman na uh, sampu pala silang magkakapatid. Mm -hmm. Kaya pala nasa dugo ni Ate Grace yung hardworking person kasi mm -hmm. napakarami nyo and yeah, for sure. Kanya-kanya, no? Mm -hmm. Ate Grace, so, sampu kayong magkakapatid. So, pang ilan ka sa sampu? I'll be the ninth. Ninth? Because I have a sister. She's mm -hmm. the youngest. Oh. Yeah. You've never so, met her, ha? Hindi pa. Oh, okay. Pero nandito siya sa, ano? She's in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. Pero dito siya nakatira dati. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, ito, guys. Uh, may pinili akong mga five or more questions uh, na tinanong nyo para kay Ate Grace. So, unang question natin, Grace, uh, galing kay Tin Ignacio. So, sabi niya, hello there. I would like to ask Ate Grace yung mga struggles niya and how she dealt with autism. Mm -hmm. Nasabi niya kasi sa isang video na may autism yung two sons mo. And same daw siya ng pinagdadaanan. So, mm -hmm. how you dealt with it? Mm -hmm. uh, first of all, I just wanted to let everyone know that when I make videos or when I say something, I'm not asking for pity because I don't need pity and I don't want pity. And as you, you guys say that I'm independent and I'm a strong woman, so no, I don't need pity. So every time me and uh, Z vlog or Z rap, we're not, I'm not asking for pity. I don't need it, okay? I just wanted to uh, make that clear. So to answer your question, mm -hmm. um, it's hard, you know, uh, there's different kinds of autism spectrum. Um, with uh, one of them has severe, the other one has moderate. So it's hard because it's like um, it's like dealing with little kids, even though they're adults. Mm -hmm. It's like uh, one of them is a first grade mentality. Mm -hmm. uh, the other one is fourth grade. So imagine you know talking to uh, an adult who has that mentality, first grade and fourth grade. So it's hard. Um, sometimes they have, um, especially the other one, sometimes he has, you know, um, 
he's got anxiety so you know sometimes he just can't take it anymore he, he can't control it or he doesn't know how to process it so mm. he has to be on medication you know sometimes that helps and it is helping him with the medication and you just have to uh, you know keep talking to them especially with with what's happening it affects them you know the other one thinks that nothing happened it's like a little kid you know they mm. don't know they just say oh I miss dad I miss dad so I just have to keep saying, um, he's not here with us. He's not with us anymore. So you have to keep telling them. Mm -hmm. But um, it's sad, but um, you know, you just, have, you just have to deal with it. Mahirap pala guys yung uh, pinagdadaanan ni Ate Grace. Pero syempre, kayang-kaya naman ni Ate Grace. Mm -hmm. Kaya nga nang sabi niya, strong and independent woman. No? Kahit siya lang mag-isa yung, syempre ngayon, kahit siya lang yung mag-isa na lumalaban and nag-aalaga. Hopefully soon, magkaroon ng katuwang sa mga. So, pangalawang question guys, galing kay Happy Heart. Open ba si Miss Grace in getting married again? Not right now, but maybe in the future. But marriage is not in my thoughts right now. Maybe just dating, getting to know other guys, but... I don't know about marriage. <laughs> so, guys, narinig nyo naman. Uh, possible na, na in the future, pwedeng mag-open si Ate Grace. Magpakasal ulit or what. Sa mga pumipila dyan, <laughs> hintay-hintay lang kayo. <laughs> Baka kayo yung swerteng mapili. <laughs> so, pangatlong question, guys, galing kay Hazel Valdez. And kung pwede mo daw bang uh, i-discuss how you cope up with the divorce. Um, in the beginning, it's so hard. It's so hard. It's like, it hurts so much. Mm -hmm. I, I don't want anyone to go through what I went through, but it's so hard. Um, there were times na I'm at work and I'm crying because it, because you just remember it. And it's like, oh my gosh, it's so sad and it hurts. Mm -hmm. And you have a broken family. You know, like you've been together for so long, 25 years, and it's gone. You know, so it's hard. So what I did was, of course, you have to have support from family, from friends, um, listening to podcasts about marriage and relationships. Um, I listen to uh, a lot of podcasts of Joel Osteen or Osteen. I don't know if you know mm. him, but he's a minister. And um, I, I listen to him a lot. And um, I read a couple of books. Um, it's mostly like talking to other people, you know, like talking about it, talking to other people who've been through it. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, even my boss said, uh, yeah, I went through that, but one day I just woke up and it's like, wow, I feel okay now. It's like, uh, it's like, okay, move on, you know? And, and there are stages of, um, of grief and I'm at the, the acceptance, mm -hmm. uh, stage where it's like, you know, it happened, fine, just move on, you know, it's like, it happens, uh, it happens to everyone, it's not just me, yeah. you know, it, it happens every day to a lot of people, so it's nothing new, but it's just that, you know, not everyone can talk about it. Mm. So, kumbaga, so, iba-ibang, ano, uh, sitwasyon, iba-iba yung, iba-iba yung sitwasyon ng ibang tao, mm -hmm. like, you know. Yeah, yeah, I mean, divorce happens, mm. we're in America, it's, uh, I wouldn't say it's normal, but it happens all the time. You know, it happens to celebrities, you know. Yeah, so lagi nyo lang tatandaan guys na sarili nyo lang yung makakatulong sa inyo para makapag-move on. No? Mm -hmm. Kasi yung ibang mga tao, pag yung kunyari nangyari yung ganyan, yeah. yung ginagawa, nagpa-party, nagiinom, so yeah. nakakalimutan nila yung mga responsibilities nila, like yung yeah. in reality na mm -hmm. sa buhay. Yeah, and so, also um, someone from my past said, move on you know like go on it's like how can you say that you know it's oh. like it's easy you it's easy for you to say uh, you're not you are it didn't happen to you i'm the one who's going through it not you so it's easy for people mm. to say move on it's like yeah. ha have you been in my situation have you gone through what i went through you know it's not that easy to say move on because i hope it doesn't happen to you or to your family members or your loved ones to be broken hearted and yeah. to lose someone, you know, you can't just say that to yeah. someone. Kasi mahirap talaga yung masiguro yung 
ilang years no may 25 years and then parang biglaan lang yeah, yun. Siyempre, alam mo gusto mo mag-move on ka na, yeah. kalimutan mo na ako, hindi naman pepede yun. Yeah, yeah, it's easy so, for them to say. It's like, uh, hope it doesn't happen to you. So, ayan guys, sinagot ni Ate Grace yun. Usually, nakakatakot yung itanong sa kanya, pero uh, para lang, ano, may matutunan din kayo sa mga sa kwento ni Ate Grace, no? Kasi, iba naman lahat, eh, ng situation, eh. Hindi naman lahat, like, o oh, madali lang ganyan ganun. Mm -hmm. Syempre pag nasa sarili ka na or ikaw sa sarili mo na, syempre kinikimkim mo na lang yung mga ibang tao na kinikimkim na lang. Tapos pag nasa ibang tao like masaya, di ba? Mukha lang tayong masaya yung mga ganun, mm -hmm. di ba? So at least guys, nakita niyo si Ate Grace na masaya ayun gumingiti. Eh syempre hindi naman natin alam pinagdaanan niya. So basta nandito lang tayo lahat. <laughs> Para lang makain si Ate Grace. Pero masaya na si Ate Grace ngayon, di ba? No, wala na, wala na yung mga... Yeah, yung, you just have to go on. It's like, dati. you know, it's like, you've, you've cried so many times, mm -hmm. you know, there were times when I would cry in my room and like later on, months later, CJ would say, oh, you're doing okay now, mom. Mm -hmm. uh, you're not crying anymore. I used to hear you cry, like, oh. in the room. I'm like, oh, you heard me? Mm -hmm. You know, or like Aaron and Jason would see me cry and they're like, are you crying, mom? I'm um, like, no, I just have allergies, you know, because like, I don't want to show it to them, you know. Yeah, so aside from ano, especially pag bata yung nagtanong, you know, mm -hmm. like nakikita kang umiyak. Pero, masaya na si Ate Grace ngayon. Oh, masaya nga ba o may nagpapasaya na? So, mapunta tayo sa susunod na tanong. <laughs> <laughs> so, pang ilan na ba? Pang four na? Pang apat na? Yeah. So, Ate Grace, ito yung uh, pang fourth question natin. Mm -hmm. uh, Mula kay Ting Marites. Mula kay Team Marites. Shoutout sa'yo, Team Marites. Fan page. <laughs> Mga fan page. So, paano mo Ate Grace na babalance yung, uh, siyempre, pag-alaga sa anak and then trabaho? Siyempre, alam naman natin dito sa Amerika, kailangan laging magtatrabaho lagi. Mm -hmm. ba? Diba? So, paano mo na babalance? Yeah. Uh, children and work. Yeah, it's hard. Um, it's I'm so busy sometimes, you know, at work and uh, before I used to drop off CJ, pick him mm -hmm. up. And then sometimes I have to uh, drop off and pick up the boys for haircut or appointments or stuff like that. And it's hard, you know, you have to uh, manage your time. And I'm so busy, sometimes I forget, you know, like, oh my gosh, I was supposed to attend a meeting and I missed oh. it because, you know, I have to like pick up, drop off appointments, you know, we have to do stuff together, you know, it's like, we have to do groceries together. We go to church every Sunday. It's uh, it's really hard, you know, especially when you're by yourself. And there's no one to help, to help, you know. Especially, I, I'm not asking any help from my family members, friends, you know, the government. I'm doing everything by myself, so it's hard. You just have to uh, manage your time. Oh, mahirap yung, lalo na yung mahirap yung may sarili kang bahay na ikaw lang. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. After add that, I have to clean the house. Yeah, di ba? Know? Kasi lalo na. Dito guys, mahirap kumuha ng bahay kapag yung, alam mo yun, parang sarili mo lang, ganyan ganyan. Pero si Ate Grace na manage pa niya lahat and then gawain bahay pa, no? Mm -hmm. Lahat. Pay the bills, pay the pay, house. Pay the bills, pay the mm -hmm. house, lahat. Millionary naman yan si Ate Grace. Pero millionary naman tong kasama ko, <laughs> yeah. payo man. Yeah, in, in the Philippine money. <laughs> Ayan guys, umami na, millionary. So ito Ate Grace, ah, pag fifth question natin, no pre? Ate Grace, ano yung masasabi mo sa mga... Siyempre maraming nagtatanong sa atin na about puro divorce or niloko, niloko, niloko or nandoko yung mga ganyan. So ano masasabi mo Ate Grace sa niloko at saka dun sa nandoko? So umpisa muna natin Ate Grace sa niloko. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Itong okay. mga marites na to, okay. Ate Grace, tatanong, sasagot din ni Ate Grace yan. Um, I think if you've been cheated on or niloko, niloko. Uh -huh, if you've been cheated on, uh, it just depends. Um, if they cheated on you, okay, maybe give them another chance. Mm -hmm. Give them another chance to prove it to, to you that it was a mistake mm -hmm. and not to do it again. But you have to be vigilant, meaning you have to be aware. Mm -hmm. it's now it's like, now you're kind of uncomfortable. It's like, uh, what's he doing now? If he's going out, who is he with? Kung baga, parang na now you're, you're panicked. Yeah, yeah. You, you don't have that trust anymore. You're always mm -hmm. going to be 
wondering, asking yourself. So, yun, yun pala yung tingin ni Ate Grace sa uh, naloko. Mm -hmm. no? So, mapunta naman tayo sa nanloko. Mm -hmm. anong, anong tingin mo sa mga nanloko? Yeah. <clears throat> well, if you love that person, why would... Nanloko. <laughs> if you love that person, why would you cheat on that person? That mm -hmm. means you don't love that person. You know, you... No, that's not, it's not mm. uh, acceptable. And that's not acceptable. Sabi nga ni Ate Grace, mm. uh, hindi siya mistake kasi it's a choice, di ba? Yeah, uh, yeah nasabi na ni Ate Grace. Kasi may mga, may mga sitwasyon na Ate Grace na, kunyari, nagawa mo lang ng isang beses na hindi mo naman, like, hindi naman talaga intention ng isang tao, di ba? Na parang nagawa lang niya in, in one night, ganyan, or na, sa panahon na yun, or sa sitwasyon na yun, tapos nahuli mo, like, Tingin mo para sa you like na cheat na or of course or... yeah I know you're talking from a man's perspective because mm. because you know it's a I'm a man of course it's like a, it's yeah, okay parang, for you uh, but what about us when we do it what no, what are we called mm -hmm. you know so no it's it's not okay mm. you know it's Mas na nagawa mo yung isang bagay na yun. oh mali ako mali ako so iniisip ng babae nun pero hindi ko alam kung lahat na iisip na pwede pa niyang gawin ulit Mm -hmm. Oo, oh, kumbaga mawawala na kasi yung trust ko niya. Oo, oh, ayoko na lumabas ka, mm -hmm. ganyan, mga ganyan. Yeah. Tsaka sa babae, sa part ng babae, pre, lagi natin silang parang yung feeling nila na invalidate natin. Mm -hmm. Kaya la lagi silang napaparanoid, pre. Gusto mo mo po dito? <laughs> Tatatapya mo ako, pre! <laughs> Tama mo yan, ha? Oh, so, ito na, la ito na yung last question natin, Grace. Maraming yung tatanong na ito, and mostly lahat ng tao, milyong-milyong tao, gustong-gustong malaman to and yun yung mga tinatanong sa atin. So, paano kayo naghiwalay? Nang puti at nang dekolor pag naglalaba ka. <laughs> Ayun yung tanong ko eh. Di ba? Pasensya na guys. Ayun yung nabasa ko dito. So, malay mo sagutin natin ni Ate Grace. Sagutin niya. Sa sa sagutin niya. Oh Kaya tayo sagutin ni Ate Grace. Of course. Yeah. So, paano, paano mo ihiwalay ate? Of course. White uh -huh. and colored. Di ba? Easy diba? na naman eh. <laughs> So yeah, Don't mix guys. them together. Or yeah. else you're gonna have brown shirt if you have a white shirt. Mm, exactly. So napaka-easy lang ng question na yun, guys. So dito na natin tatapusin tong uh, interview natin part 2 dito sa Choose Ko Po. Vlog natin dito sa Choose One Vlogs channel. So, <laughs> syempre thank you ulit Ate Grace dahil uh, pumayag ulit sa pangalaw natin interview sa iyo, no? And syempre sa susunod, sana naman si Wonder C, ano ba yan, di pa rin magpa-interview sa akin. Medyo exclusive <laughs> daw siya. <laughs> VIP. Mahal TF. Ma Mahal lang TF, so hindi ko po ma-afford si Wonder C na interview. Pero abangan nyo, marami pa tayong uh, lalabas na videos. And abangan nyo po yung music video kong ginagawa ngayon, yung kanta kong pangarap. And sa mga oh. kanta ko pang, kung gusto nyo pong uh, ma-afford kong interviewin si Wonder C, paabutin nyo po itong ng maraming maraming likes, tsaka i-share nyo po itong videos namin para afford na afford na natin si Wonder C, you no? Know? <laughs> 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 Woo, mahal mo! So ayan guys, maraming maraming salamat, maraming maraming salamat ate Grace. Thank you. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe para maabot natin si Wonder C. <laughs> Let's go! Skirt! Hayaan mo muna ang problema Darating din ang tama na panahon Halika na at sumama Maaabot din kahit di pa ngayon Halika sabutin ang pangarap At darating din naman tayo doon